Hello guys, welcome to Britain's Got Talent Highlights and News. Amanda Holden's brutal confession about why she ended her relationship with ex-husband Le Dennis resurfaces. Amanda Holden's brutal confession about why she ended her relationship with ex-husband Le Dennis has resurfaced. In 1993 Amanda, who was 22 at the time, fell in love with the Family Fortunes host, then 40, when they were both starring in a production of The Sound of Music. They married two years later but things came to a crashing close when it was revealed that Amanda had an affair with her Shakespeare co-star Neil Morrissey in 2000, something she later insisted was just about sex. In resurfaced quotes from Amanda, now 52 at the time of the split, she said she was very broody and could see herself having multiple children in the next couple of years. The presenter explained, I terribly want children but I didn't want to have them with Leigh. That's a horribly brutal thing to say, but when you do, you know you have to move on. She went on to admit it was her who finally suggested getting a divorce to Dennis, and later spoke out about her affair in the spotlight. She said, I found the fall from grace incredibly hard to deal with. I can't bear not to be liked. Then I had an affair and overnight turned into this awful person. There are no hard feelings with Le. I wish him the best, but we've both moved on. I don't believe women have affairs for no reason. Women don't seek sex. We seek love and affirmation. Dennis became the first star to be booted off Strictly Come Dancing on Sunday night. The TV personality, 69, who left the show with his pro-partner Nancy Exu, recently made a surprising confession about his former love after their difficult past. Speaking to the Sunday Times recently, he said he was over what happened and was happy for her in her new life. He said, Amanda was in the papers recently, saying some nice things about me, that was very kind of her, maybe with time she has been able to look back and see things differently. We're not in touch but I am happy that she's happy. I can watch Britain's Got Talent without getting angry. To be honest it's like watching a different person, someone I've never met. All the hurt that has happened has been healed. Dennis, who is now married to his third wife Claire Nicholson, even considered the prospect of Amanda playing herself in the movie of his life. Speaking on the White Wine Question Time podcast, Dennis opened up about the idea of a hypothetical biopic saying, I suppose Amanda would have to be there. It's a chapter in my life that was huge, and I have no idea who to cast in that role. Speaking about the split afterwards, Ems Holden said, I brought it on myself, I appreciate that, but nothing will ever be as bad again. It was a very dark time. It got to the point where I felt I could hardly breathe. She later said, In some ways, I've always admired him for the way he doesn't try to hide his real emotions. He's honest about how he feels. My trouble is that I'm a people pleaser. I might feel down in the dumps, but I'll always put on a bright face for the rest of the world. And I'm ruled by my heart, not my head. I always have been, and it gets me into trouble. I'm not an enigma. I've wished all my life that I could be mysterious. But I ain't. I don't know what it is about me but people have always picked up on the slightest comment or some insignificant thing I've done, and suddenly I'm all over the papers again. In 2014 Morrissey finally said sorry to game show host Dennis for the affair he had with his then-wife Enns Holden. The star who has previously said he had not apologized to Dennis, made the admission on Piers Morgan's life stories. He said, I feel sorry for how the situation was dealt with, and I feel sorry for how emotional Les seemed to become. It was very difficult for him, and for that I'm sorry. His comment came after he was asked by Morgan if he had ever apologized to Dennis, to which he replied, No, I didn't. I'm not positive over what there's apologize about. I don't know what the whole situation was to be perfectly fair to everybody. Earlier this year, Dennis appeared to take a swipe at his ex-wife after she posted a slew of saucy snaps from Paris to her Instagram. As Holden shared an array of snaps of herself out for an evening in the French capital. Dennis then cheekily posted a picture from his less than luxurious dressing room as he tours the country with musical 42nd Street writing, not in Paris, in Leicester. Prior to his marriage to Enns Holden, he was married to Lynn Webster, with whom he shares son Philip, from 1974 to 1990. As Holden, meanwhile, has been married to Chris Hughes since 2009 and they share two daughters. In July, Dennis recalled the surprising first time he laid eyes on Hughes. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel to see more talents.